Fire Emblem. Engage. Hey everybody, the Great Pikmin CX79 here, and welcome back to, to Let's Play Fire Emblem Engage. The final scene along has been added. Once you complete this new story, new allies will join your group, and the Enchanter and Mage Kennedy of classes will become available. So yeah, I was in the middle of trying to uh, casually get back up to having a fire well. I haven't married anybody in these files. <laughs> Look at all these things I'm not going to use. Divine One, we have been getting reports lately of a strange presence coming from this well. I have not been able to find anything unusual about it, but perhaps you should investigate. You can access the fell scene log from the Asian well. You do not have to pay it all at once. You can return to the world of the main story between chapters if you like. The first scene log also has a difficulty setting separate from that of the main game. So, yeah. I've heard that this is going to be a little bit harder than the main story. And uh, since this is technically a blind playthrough of the scene along, uh, I'm gonna change it to normal. <laughs> Oh, who am I kidding? <laughs> right? Oh, here we go. Dragons from a fall. Faced one way, a thousand years separation. The other way, a hundred years regret. Pray, dream of my sorrow. Pray. Dispel the darkness from this world. The only light here is in memory. And the hope you instilled flickers. Alas, I know the truth. In this world, there is no salvation. In this world, there is no you. Where am I? This isn't the Somniel. Who are you? <laughs> Pardon? I am. No, it is no matter. My name lost its meaning long ago. But I have this strange feeling. As if the two of us have met somewhere. We have never met before. Not in any way you would understand. I'm speaking to you from across a mirror. You are my reflection, and my land's last hope. Please. I need your assistance. Will you save those who are important to me? Of course. I'll help however I can. Really? You accept my plea without hearing what it entails? <laughs> I suppose I feel like helping you might ease some of my own anxieties. Almost as if this is a chance to get back. Something that I lost a long time ago. In short, yes, I'm here for you. I'm glad to hear you say so. I was afraid you would refuse, since I'm unable to explain all the details. Suffice to say that the land I speak of is threatened by a foe with a wicked heart. The only hope for my people is for you to collect the seven bracelets. Bracelets? In my world, emblems dwell inside bracelets. You will need them in order to succeed. Now, I will transport you there. Those you encounter after arriving will guide you. Will you and I meet again? We will not. Nor have we ever met. Not even in this very moment. You speak so cryptically. Still, I get the feeling I will see you again. <laughs> am I now? Oh, am I sure we're gonna see this mysterious person again? That mysteriously looks like... Our oh, female counterpart. I don't know what to say. Be off now. I thank you, and wish you good fortune in the battles ahead. Dad! Goodbye, my fellow divine dragon. 
my twin from another world. On your journey, I hope you feel joy, suffering, sorrow, and love, because I will feel nothing anymore. I will never awaken again. Ugh. So bright. Nah. Sister, it worked! Our prayers are answered! After all these long years, at last our savior has come. <clears throat> you... Is that... Where am I? You are in Lethos Castle. We have long awaited your arrival. Thank you for answering our prayers. I am Nell, one of the dragons who resides here. And I am Nell, her twin brother. It's nice to meet you, Nell. And you, Nell. I'm the Divine Dragon. Huh? So you are the Divine Dragon. Fate has made a cruel and mysterious choice. <clears throat> it is such a joy to see you reborn. Reborn? What does that... The Divine Dragon is deceased. You fell in the last war. Our world has been consumed by darkness in the time since. We have long prayed for a savior to aid us. And your appearance seems to be our answer. It is unfortunate. I would have preferred never to see you again. No! But we are in desperate need of aid. And we do not have the luxury of choice. I will speak no more of it. Please follow me. <laughs> okay. I'm so sorry, Divine One. She is rather more upset by this than I would have expected. She and the Divine Dragon have a somewhat complicated history. This is the Bracelet Vault. Here, our emblem bracelets are kept secure. I see. Upon that pedestal lies the bracelet of the Shepherd Exile. <laughs> oh cool! We get Kwame Wombat for free! It is the sole bracelet in our possession. The emblems within it are safely in slumber. There are seven bracelets in total. We lost the other six in the war with Sombron. So, he exists in your world as well. I will explain from the beginning. The first dragons were born millennia ago, and from them came the divine and fell dragons. For a time, there was peace, until the fell dragons turned to conquests and destruction. With the world under threat, the divine dragons and the people prayed for salvation. And that salvation came in the form of beings from other worlds known as emblems. The emblems were manifestations of those ardent prayers for peace. My sister and I were performing that ancient rite when you arrived. We thought a new emblem would appear to save us. And you got me. Yes, it was quite the shock. I'm still a bit beside myself. The emblems brought an end to the fighting, but only temporarily. A thousand years ago, Sombron sought to exploit the emblems for his own ambitions. We experienced that war firsthand. It was awful. The entire continent became a battlefield. The dragons and the royal families fought over the emblems until all sides were exhausted. But as we stood upon the brink of annihilation, the divine dragons won a key victory. Lumera, the divine dragon monarch, imprisoned fell dragon Sombron at the cost of her life. My mother died a thousand years ago? This is a good gravy. Her sacrifice bestowed peace upon the people even as they mourned her passing. But it was her successor who healed the wounded land and returned it to prosperity. Her successor? You mean the next Divine Dragon Monarch? Yes. You. <laughs> the Divine Dragon Monarch after Lumera was her own begotten child. So I took the throne after she died. This is so different from the history of my world. <laughs> you are a wonderful ruler. I, I, I'm sure I was. Under your reign, it seems like the world would be at peace for the rest of time. But it was not to be. Sombron eventually returned, and another war began. Whosoever gathers all seven of the awakened emblems will be granted immense power. Sombron intended to use that power to exact revenge and restore the Fell Dragon's honor. To achieve that end, he was willing to set the whole world ablaze. And I take it I lost this war. No. Not exactly. You and Sombron each slew the other. On the night of the decisive clash, you and he perished at the same moment. Okay, so Sombron is dead, along as the me in this world, I guess, if we want to quote unquote go there. 
<laughs> this just makes me curious about what's gonna happen. So the fell dragon is already gone? Then who is it that's putting your world in danger now? An unknown malefactor is attempting to fulfill the late Sombron's ambitions. They come and go without a trace. We know nothing of their whereabouts or appearance. All we know for sure is that, like Sombron, this individual wants to collect the seven bracelets. In fact, we believe they already have two. One in Lethos Castle, two in enemy hands. Where are the other four? Each of the four nations of Elios possesses one. They once fought under a single banner, but that changed drastically after your death. Now, with nothing to unite them, the little ones, the humans, bicker among themselves. Thus far, they have kept one another in check, but war could break out at any moment. I don't know if the Divine Dragon's army was ever truly united. I saw them argue, in this very castle, about which nation was to blame for your death. <laughs> They're that Wiestwick and good gravy. Which is absurd, of course. It was no one's fault. Now that our savior has arrived, it is imperative we reclaim the bracelets. The conflict we have avoided for years will soon be inevitable. You may need to cross blades with people who resemble your own friends and allies. I understand. I'll brace myself for that possibility. So, you're both divine dragons, like me? Mm, how do I say this? What gave you that impression? You said you were dragons, and you live in Lethos Castle, so I just assumed. Your assumption is incorrect. Uh, what she means, Divine One, is that we... Um, uh, why would I have thought? Watch out! Assassins! No! <laughs> She's a fell dragon! My brother and I both. In this world, fell dragons are born as twins. We severed ties with our father during the last war. We now fight against our misguided kin. I cannot transform, but that does not stop me from fighting at Nell's side. Fell dragon twins. I suppose I simply assumed that you would already know what we were. It seems I was mistaken. If you will not aid us, you may leave. We will defend this world ourselves. No. I'll fight with you. I don't care about your heritage. If you truly want to protect this world, I'll be your ally. Ah, oh, that's a relief. Now, let us march into battle together, just like the good old days. Show us your medal, Divine One. We shall see if you are truly the answer to our prayers. <laughs> I just love Nail's dragon form. <laughs> Even if it does with some of some on like slidey, I, I just love it. In first year long battles, your allies will have predetermined classes and levels. The, their inventory is also predetermined, but you can swap items between your units normally. Allies who fall in battle will return afterward, regardless of your difficulty settings. Which is unique allies who will join you in each battle as guests. Now it's a powerful dragon unit, now it's a capable support unit, in conjunction with emblems, but it's not really suited to the front lines. Using either now or now accounts to defeat, so be careful when using them. Let's just go right into it, I guess. The enemy has most likely come for the bracelet of the Shepherd Exalt. We must stop them here before they can reach its location. Ooh. <laughs> Damn, I'm already liking this name already. <laughs> Gameplay settings? Okay. Yeah, okay, that was a little bit weird, okay. Uh, go ahead and fade a fog. Give me a task. I'll do my best. Miss. Yes. 
Sounds perfect. Happily. Also, you might notice that Mel has a familiar weapon. And so does Mel. The weapons we just come from these wells, well, from the well, were these two special weapons. So yeah, that's the thing I... Should also probably give the member wings now, I think about it. <laughs> Go ahead. All right. <laughs> Miss. Let us begin. Sure. Off I go. Yes. I'm gonna punch the crap out of you. <laughs> Cute, right? But watch out. Those fangs will really leave a mark. with my restore staff. Give it to someone who can use it. The mind of a corrupted wolf makes the status effect called Cursed Fangs. Each attack of a Cursed Fangs will reduce the max HP of the effective unit by 5. That's a little dangerous. The Cursed Axe is each and last for the rest of the battle as you will be using restore staff. I mean, buddy, that, went, that really doesn't matter because now it's your job. <laughs> and also because the fog exists. Fade of fog. Ow. Oh, if the user will fix it. Okay, so... Now if it counterattacks, just... When it actually just... When it's the enemy's turn to attack. Okay. That makes sense. I'll go first. Thunder. Okay, now it's dead. Twice.
to finish. <laughs> I've that long in the battle, and so it's just critical hit. Good job, girl. That's my life. Ow. Ah, uh, no, I don't have a. <laughs> Would have been nice if I had a physic, but no, that would have been a little too easy. As well, we gotta go slowly but steadily. Slow and careful wins the race. Allow me. Boop. Uh. How dare! Goodness, okay. Restore we'll you. Thanks a lot. Give me an order. Fade of fog. Uh, let's go ahead and punch it. Oh, <laughs> nice. <laughs> 18 oh, damage. Oh my gosh, twice! Oh. That's like the first time I've seen a muscle artist quit in the Italian Let's Play. Good gravy. Okay, Sean. Already doing a wonderful job in this world. Miss. Yes. Uh, let's go up here. Well, the game's already over. <laughs> I can fight no longer. Let's just go like this, maybe. Cheers. I just have. You go on this side. Okay, we only got one quit this time, but oh well. Troublesome. I am stronger now. Kill you.
Let's hear it. I'm going to do a, a bit of a smart thing and. Right, you don't have the ability to hear yourself. That's a little bit of a nook, some problem we have on hand. Um, fuck. I need to be more diligent. Okay, to very least, I can move you back. Uh, I'm just gonna go up here to protect you. Ow. Let's go! Go, Yanaka! Even in another world, here we come a powerful th Okay. <laughs> well, reinforcements aren't as helpful as I want them to be. Uh, I can restore you with Sean and. I could just restore you as no. You're a lifesaver. I was I came here now. Here we go. There we go. I do gotta get over to that mysterious figure and probably soon. There's a little too many enemies going around for my liking. Here and heal Yanaka. Big help. That's probably good idea that I have two healers on the field, not just one. It doesn't have that these guys are approaching. Um Here it's one of you, but that's about it, unless no. Cool. I can only send to the kill one of you. A dream made manifest. Uh, damage is gonna be done either way. Can do them possibly reach? That's like a huge depending factor on if like I kill one of these guys as like a quit or something. I mean, unless the killer them was this, then maybe that would explain a lot. Uh. Where we'll goes this one? I must end it. I live to fight again. Okay, so you're safe. And I can. There's spots around, so I should be totally fine. After that, I'm waiting to save my engage plus for Yonaka, so, uh... Bonded Shield. Oh. Went for Yonaka instead, okay. Fair choice. Ow. 
าThey at the very least are poisoned. I can go ahead and finish you off. My heroic friends. Yanaka here. You can kill I uh, no. You are very far, my friend. Okay, well, I can kill you, but I'm gonna be vulnerable in this day, but you know what? It's fine. I'll change the future into hope. Yeah, and I think I'll just attack you. Ah, yep. <laughs> Ow. Ow. Kill any dying. Kill any in the not good department. You can mend me. Because we already have another recovery staff. Thankfully. Bring you over here. And then have you restore me. That helps. Okay, well, so stop. Fuck you. Yeah. We're gonna start approaching. Well, at least try to. I do want to get my engage plus ready. Was that too much? Oh. Beating that one, not with my emblem's power protecting it. <laughs> okay, uh, the situation has changed, preferably a lot. <laughs> I'm gonna pummel the crap out of you. Nothing to fear. Fade of fog. Oh, what the fuck? Is this because I'm a failure? I can... I mean, I guess it's fair that that if you're not gonna get to quit, you mean at least get to quit. What the fuck was that? Okay, um... New plan? Don't bring your nails. Just fucking don't. Ting on even. <laughs> We're gonna be fucking smart about this. Yeah. 
Ow. Well, fuck me, I guess. That doesn't work either. Is this really how it ends? There's no future without you. Don't go. Back to turn again. Okay, well, at the very least, they don't change much from it. You can make it here just fine. Alright, so they're just waiting to turn trying to get it closer. Oh, fuck, even he's approaching, uh. I am running out of options! This is not how this is supposed to go. Okay, now, uh... Fuck up someone range. Ow. Ow. The enemy's on the spot, no! Oh <laughs> okay, it's very easy to kill this one. I can shield you up there and put you at heal. You'll essentially be fine. I just need you not to block this path. There we go. Thank you, Yonaka. Nailed it. Nope. Ow. Ow. Stop it. Our foes are strong. Yeah, no, no shit. Our foes are strong. Uh... Kind of you. I can put you right there. Just need you not gonna play distraction a little longer. I'll do my best. Okay, so if I'm doing that, I'm just gonna be killed more, more than likely. So I just att attack his liberation. And then I'll wait here. I know I'm essentially leaving myself in attack range, but as soon as I can bring it. You know, this is the exact reason I have you on Mikhail. It was Mikhail. Please, lend me your strength. Great sacrifice! If this means survival, here I go! Yeah, 
You're not gonna get any experience it, sorry, because this is the DLC, but you know. It'll help nonetheless. It'll help nonetheless. I'll bring you up here to give you for that. Ow. Hand over the brace. No. Okay, well, he we kind of screwed himself there by just making a fire there. Um. Shit. Uh, Still in it. No, let's be smart about this. Keep going. All right, so let's heal me first. Thank you. Both of these are capable of reaching me from there, and I don't like that. One bit. That's why I wasn't on fire, I'd be able to do something about it, but I I'll be careful. really freaking can't. Uh, let's just heal both of you. Uh, and then I go... Yeah, I'll place you here, just so you can block off one of these guys. While I... I think you're not gonna attack this guy from a distance. Okay, good, we're calling kicks. Alright, engage plus. Emblem eternal. Fuck you. <laughs> okay, as for you... You can reach over here, I don't want to waste time quite yet. I don't see how this guy can reach. This guy might reach for sure, but I don't know if this guy is capable of reaching beyond simply being able to walk past fire. I can at least. But then there's a wall that's gonna tag, that's that's my issue. Okay, so it does fucking end, okay. Well I can Yeah. <sighs> Okay. Let's try this again. Let's go, though. Yeah. 
Okay, what's this weapon? I won't forget you. Yes. Thanks a lot. Okay, so Your your whisk. Okay, you'll be fine. What's not fine though is me. Who never mind. Ow. Do these guys have any unique dialogue other than just... just okay, I don't, I don't want this good. And just for that, no. Get pew pew, though. I'll just kill you so I can just overkill your boss, okay? Whee! Let's go! We did it, Divine One! Fine, you know what was up. I'm not badly hurt. Okay, there we go, whiskey. Okay, maybe, maybe not with that. <laughs> maybe not with that. Uh, fuck you. Okay, no, now I can do the thing that I want to. And now I can overkill you. Are you... the Divine Dragon? Yes. And I'll be taking back that bracelet now. With the divine dragon, engage blast! Now that was fun. He won. This time. MVP! I was hoping we would finally learn their identity.
At least we got back the bracelet they were carrying. That's... The bracelet of the Ancestor. It seems... different since we last laid eyes on it. <laughs> the Emperor mo The bracelet looks the freaking same. The Emperor, on the other hand... Hmm. Maybe this emblem can tell us about their time in enemy hands. I'll summon them again so we can talk. Huh? That's strange. What? The invocation isn't coming to me. Perhaps it's because I'm in a new world? But that's no good. Summoning emblems is what a divine dragon... does. Divine dragon? I'm Tiki. Are you a divine dragon? Like me? Sorry, it's so painful to hear Tiki's voice like this. Well... Impossible! Emblems in this state shouldn't be able to speak. Hello, Emblem Tiki. I might be able to summon you again, but your invocation isn't coming to me. Do you know it? I don't know anything about an invocation. <sighs> My head feels fuzzy. It hurts. Please, don't make me fight anymore. I don't like hurting people. You need not act against your will. Allow me to return you to peaceful slumber. You can do that? I can indeed. But I am unfamiliar with this summoning power of which you speak. The divine dragon of this world was able to cleanse fallen emblems. And because we're not in this world, we can't do that. It would seem that you cannot do the same. So I will send Emblem Tiki to rest. In slumber, she will be safe from those who would exploit her power. No longer will she be compelled to fight. You might say we are containing her power in the bracelet. Sadly, since we lack the ability to awaken emblems, she cannot aid us any further. It sounds like our only option right now. Please, go ahead. Whatever benefits there might be to keeping her awake, I won't force her to fight. Tiki, I hope we'll meet again someday. I'd like that. When we do, let's play together lots, okay? Absolutely. Farewell, Emblem Tiki. Sweet dreams. <sighs> night, night. Now, so long as we keep her away from the enemy, she will be able to rest. Thank you, Nell. We place our emblems into slumber as a matter of course, to prevent their exploitation. Emblem Tiki was thus asleep when she was taken, but she returned to us awake. Our foe must therefore possess the power to awaken emblems. Only divine and fell dragons can control them in that way. There are no divine dragons left in this world, so that means our enemy is a fell dragon. One of our siblings, in other words. If it's a sibling of yours, then do you have any idea who it could be? We have many brothers and sisters, but we're not acquainted with all of them. Many died in the most recent war. There is no telling which of them survived. The power to control emblems is rare. If we knew the culprit, we would surely recall. Perhaps this child was born after we left Sombron. Or developed this power late. Dragon powers are unpredictable. I cannot transform myself or control emblems at all. Sombron deemed me a failure. If I had stayed with him, I would probably be dead by now. How awful. I managed to survive only because Nell took me with her when she left. <sighs> it angers me to think that our siblings could be behind this. To be given that kind of power, only to use it for evil. What a waste. Nell. <laughs> uh, sorry. It's not my intention to poison the mood. So, Divine One. Our objective is to put an end to the ambitions of Sombron's mysterious heir. Since we are fighting to return the emblems to slumber, they will not be able to help us. Knowing this, it is your choice whether or not to join our cause. What say you? Yes, I'll help. <gasps> Splendid! It is such a comfort to have you on our side, isn't it now? After what I saw in that battle, I must agree. But I will remain unsettled by the necessity of fighting alongside this... dead dragon. Oh, I unsettle you, do I? Please, there is no need to quarrel! 
Why don't the two of you shake hands and agree to be friends from now on? I decline. Then I guess I'll pass too. <laughs> you could at least try to get along. Before we depart the castle, Nil, we should say our farewells. Oh, agreed. I didn't know anyone else was in the castle. Is it a person I know? You are welcome to come find out. But what you see may upset you. Hmm. Well, it's not like we have no toys. It looks to be a monument of some kind. This is the resting place of the Divine Dragon. Your grave. <laughs> I did warn you. We will be just a moment, Divine One. You can go back if you like. Actually, do you mind if I say something? I'd like to speak to my other self, who lived here with you. I think that would be a lovely gesture. Visiting my own gravestone. Not something I ever thought I'd do. I can see why Nell is unsettled by... this situation. Hmm. I promise to fulfill your role, and protect those important to you as best I can. And with that, my reflection, goodbye. Why can I turn into a dragon like you and father? There, there. You may someday. I'm a failure. I'm weak. No, Nell. You are strong. Surely you will be able to transform eventually. When? Not even father can say for sure. But until then, hold on to this. Your dragon stone? But you won't be able to transform without it. I can if you carry it for me. And I know you will always be by my side. We are two halves of a whole, Nell. This power is ours to share. <sighs> Our power.